friends, Miranda here, and today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So, fall still has not hit my stores yet. Man, I don't know what's taking forever. Keep seeing all this awesome, awesome fall stuff. I'm loving the pumpkins this year, and like, oh my goodness, the signs are just so beautiful. So I'm hoping how fall gets to my Dollar Tree very, very soon. But anywho, let me go ahead and show you guys what I did pick up. So I found these right here, you guys. They are these little uh, Disney Junior paint your own posters. So you get two in here. It comes with a little like paint set and stuff at the bottom and the paintbrush. And then you get the two posters in here. So they do have the Fancy Nancy one. Um, then they did also have the Trolls. They also had Mickey Mouse. And they also had Toy Story 4. And these are just always so nice to have on hand for one of those days when the kids are just, I don't know, maybe bored and you just want to give them something to do. This is like the perfect little um, thing for them. So they had these back, you guys. And these work amazing. I highly recommend these. These are the lens wipes. Um, they are in little individual packages. You get 12 in each uh, package here. But oh my goodness, you guys, like seriously, these work amazing. So if you can get your hands on these, grab a bunch of them because they do. They really, really work. And like I can see clearly, <laughs> so clear when I use these like on my glasses, you guys. So I went ahead and picked up a few packages because they hadn't had them in for a while. I went ahead and picked up some more of the Assured Allergy Relief. Um, this stuff has been working great for us for allergies this season for me and hubby. Um, and so we're out now. So I went ahead and picked up some more to have on hand for the rest of the season. Then when they have cute puzzles, I like to pick them up, you guys. I'm not much of a puzzle person. Like I have a bunch that I picked up and I will do them one day. I, I promise. <laughs> but um, I thought this one was really super cute. Um, I haven't decided maybe if I want to put this like in the bathroom or like the kitchen area or maybe even the dining room. I don't know yet, but I thought this was really cute. 300 pieces like puzzles for a dollar, you guys. They have puzzles that are up to like a thousand pieces, 500, all of that. And that's just an awesome, awesome deal, you guys. Um, and this is by Cardinal. It's pretty much it's a Greenbrier brand, but really great deal. And it's super cute, you guys. Next, I went down the book aisle. I found a couple. I found this one here. It's by Barbara Leslie, and it's called Unhinged. It sounded really good. It has to do a lot with, like, some girl. She was on crack and about her going through rehab. And then um, something I believe was, like, her sister died or something like that. But um, it sounded really interesting, you guys. So I went ahead and picked this up. It doesn't say how much it retails for, but it looks like there's also a couple of other books in the series. There's one that's Barbara Leslie Cracked and then Rehab Run. So that would be interesting to find the rest of the series here. Um, and then I did also pick up this one here. It's called Lucky Boy. And this one retails for $27, you guys. I just think books at Dollar Tree, they've been getting so many good ones in. It's actually a really thick book. Um, but any book you, you can get for a dollar, that's just so amazing when it comes to like these big old chapter books and like all the just the awesome, awesome books that have been coming out. And basically this book is about a girl. She came from Mexico, you know, with the same dreams as like everybody and then things just did not go as planned she ended up pregnant and so i'm thinking that if, since it's called lucky boy she had a boy so i'm assuming that the book's going to be like about her son and whatnot so we'll see how this is but it sounds interesting they got me again you guys so dollar tree has been coming out with some awesome awesome socks you guys really cute um, so this one, these are all new ones that I've seen, and these are two packs, you guys. Gotta jump on the two packs. So this one has the cute little pizzas on it, the pink with the pizzas, and then you get the striped ones. Then they had these cute little cupcake ones with the polka dot ones as well. This one I thought was so adorable. Look at the little sloths, like how cute. And you get some polka dot ones. But of course, these ones are my absolute favorite, you guys. Check out the narwhals. How stinking cute. 
Oh my goodness, I love those. And then you got heart ones on the back. And then these ones I just picked up because um, I really like these kind of socks. They're the uh, ultra light low cut socks. They're more, they kind of have like the, this part here. I don't know what the heck you want to call this. Um, what does it say? Does it say? It says met, uh, like for ventilation. That's what I was trying to think of. But yeah, you get two in here. I just picked these ones up. They had other colors as well. But I do, I really like these socks, especially like for work. My feet kind of sweat a lot. So these would be like perfect for that. So they had these cute little headband sets here, you guys. They both have unicorns on them. Um, but this one is in the blue. And then behind it, you get just a solid black. And then there's the pink one. And you get like a solid kind of turquoise color so I thought that those were really cute and they are by Stylin' Girls I've never heard of the brand but obviously it's got to be a name brand so um they had some other like little hair ties that went along with this line they were like fuzzy ones but I didn't really care for those ones too much but the headbands were super super cute next up I need to do a little bit of organization on my little um like craft shelf thing that I have over there. So I got this little basket set. You get three in here. Um, nothing special, but I, I went ahead and picked those up. And then I got actually two sets of these ones. These ones you get two. And they're like the kind of bigger baskets here. So yeah, I need to do some organizing. All right, so these were like forever on my wish list, you guys. My dollar store finally got them in. It's the LED projector light. I've seen people do reviews on it. They say it works really, really great, so I am excited to try this out. It takes two AAA batteries, but basically, yeah, pretty much that's what it looks like. Um, it shows, like, little stars and whatnot. Um, just says, projects lighting effects across your ceiling, and it has, like, the little light, and I believe you can just, like, stand this up. Yeah. And then, so, yeah. So they have it in purple, you guys, and then they also have it in blue. So I went ahead and I picked them both up. I don't know. I'm assuming it's just the color that's going to be different. Or maybe the, also the design that it projects. It looks like the designs are different. This one looks more like, you know, kind of like galaxy kind of background, like a darker blue. Well, this one is like the purple and it has like stars and spots and stuff. So I'm excited to try these out. So my daughter was with me and, of course... As I mentioned before, she loves her puzzles. I saw this though, because normally dollar store for kid puzzles, they only carry like 24 or 48, or even just in general, I've never seen a puzzle with just 63 pieces. So, I mean, she's doing 100 piece puzzles, but I mean, a 63 piece like would be a piece of cake for her. Um, but I thought it was super cute. It's frozen. And so yeah, she got this for her. I was excited to find these. These were actually in the baby section, you guys. Now, these are the Paw Patrol Stuffy Nose Wipes. You get 25 in here. And um, it's just, it says extra soft wipes to clean little noses and faces. And they have vitamin E in them, you guys. thought this was so cute to have on hand. So I went ahead and picked up a couple packages of these. All right, you guys. So my dollar it, it's funny that my dollar tree just now got these in because i literally just found these ones anyways the mild cheddar ones in my last grocery outlet haul that i did you guys um these are freaking good okay they weren't quite exactly what i was expecting they're more of like that airy kind of texture going on like a puff not like a puff like a cheeto puff but you know kind of oh how the heck like a I don't know how to explain it, but they weren't the texture I was expecting, but they're really, really good. You guys, I like them. So it's funny that Dollar Tree got them in now that I just found them, but they also had the smoked Gouda and I have not tried these ones. So if these ones are good. I'm excited to try these ones out. So I went ahead and picked up just one bag of this and I picked up two bags of this. Next by Bountiful Harvest, I found these multi-grain chips and basically it's like a, um, Oh my gosh, why can't I think of the name right now? <laughs> like a sun chip. Oh my goodness. Okay, I have some in my pantry and I cannot think of the name. Like sun chips, you guys. Sun chips are honestly like one of my most favorite chips like ever. Um, so they had it here in the sea salt flavor. And like this is new. I've never seen this before. So they had the sea salt flavor. And then they also had it in the cheddar cheese flavor. So I'm curious to see how these compare to the original sun chips. 
Next up, they had this again. Oh my goodness, this is my most favorite flavor of Chex Mix. It's the sweet and salty, the honey nut flavor. So, so good, you guys. So I went ahead and stocked up. I got like five bags of this. Probably should have gotten more because they'll probably not have any left next time I go. But this is an 8.75 ounce bag. And for a dollar, that's an awesome deal, you guys. Delicious. I highly recommend if you guys have never had this flavor. Had to get some more of my strawberry applesauce. Loving this stuff lately. The kiddos are too. Of course, I always get my handy dandy good sense kitchen bags. I love the handled ones. Not so much any of the other ones, but these ones, they work fabulous. Uh, a couple more items here, you guys. Uh, I came across the Haribo watermelon slices. And, you know, I love Haribo and I love, like, anything like this. You know, like the sour candies, gummy candies, that kind of stuff. So, got those. And then this. So... I had not seen um, this previously when I found Bolero stuff. Like, I didn't recall there being a face wash. But I found in the Hibiscus Pink Clay um, the face wash. So I'm excited to try this out. Like, the face wash is definitely one of the newer Bolero products. It's one that they never used to have out before. Um, but I, I do like this scent. This is a really nice scent, you guys. Um, so I'm excited to try out this face wash. That is it for this haul, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, guys.